Doug here in the live room of Soundpure Studios, and today we're going to be discussing the 22251, which personally I find to be one of the most versatile vintage style tube microphones that John Peluso has built. Um, this kit comes with everything that you're going to need to get up and running. It has, of course, the microphone, the nine polar pattern power supply, the shock mount, and then the proprietary cables. Now let's see some acoustic guitar clips using a pair of 251s in a spaced cardioid pattern. The microphone is really well constructed, has a nice weight to it, uh, really well finished, um, well machined, uh, and again, nine polar patterns, which makes this microphone very versatile versus some of the more standard vintage microphones. As you see, the, the patterns in between Omni, as you get closer to cardioid, are going to start from Omni, and they're going to be wider towards narrower as you get closer to cardioid. As you come from cardioid to figure eight, you're going to get a more focused or a more narrow polar pattern that is going to give you more off-axis rejection. The 251 is one of the earlier sought-after vintage microphones that has been around for a very long time. This microphone we are going to find is not hyped like a lot of other vintage microphones. It doesn't have a really bright top end. It doesn't have a really full, heavy bottom. It is going to be a microphone that is going to give you a very natural, warm, but natural sound that is going to have a lot of detail to it. It has a very flat frequency response. Again, especially for a vintage style microphone, which you're going to find is going to work well everywhere from grand piano, uh, vocals, as well as one of our favorite places to use it is on location in a stereo pair for ensemble and chamber music work. Now that you've heard the clips of the 251, if you guys have any questions about the 251 or any of the techniques or other equipment we used in creating these sound clips, feel free to give anybody here at SoundPure a call.